Okay, y'all. Yeah. Okay. Hey, back. Woo. Revenge. All right, y'all. For today's episode of Tasty Tuesdays with Leroy. What's up? Welcome back. We'll be doing an addition on some wine. We had three different types of wine. We got our wine connoisseur, Antoine Moss, with us to give us some info on it. How everybody doing today? So to start off, we're going to let you leave right talk to y'all for a minute. I on the uh, previous episode, we had a Jack Daniels, and we did that, uh, what, four, five different types. And we also had a back to school giveaway. We sponsored two kids with all supplies. Thank you for all the people responding and thank tagging you, me in the post. You. Appreciate it. And we appreciate that. You know, it was a very special thing to do. And it's all about giving back and helping each other out. And we hope to continue to shout out to everybody who had a back to school event and helped the kids out. And shout out to the people who are still doing it. Kids first. Kids, kids first. first. All right. And next we got, don't forget to go to 1103 North Main Street in Fountain Inn. And holler at Fountain Inn Wines and Spirits. They got the best prices in all of the upstate. I mean, I'm going to the upstate period, man. They right. got the best prices. So we're going to start it off with this wine right here, Leroy. Tell us a little bit about that. All right, this wine we got here is a uh, sweet red wine. It's a Renewit uh, Lambrusco. Okay, and we're going to give you a few facts on it here. The, the Lambrusco was made in Italy, and it's, uh, it got about 8% alcohol content in it. And it's usually served with an everyday dinner or uh, after dinner. Some people have it with their dinner. And then another one, uh, fact about this, between $13 to $20 for this bottle here. To make the bottle smaller, they probably be like $5 to $6 for a smaller bottle. That's what kind of if, you go, if you go to Walmart, you can get that bottle for about $8. $8 $8 oh, at yeah. Walmart. Right. Okay. And then it's best served with uh, fatty foods. And it's one of the oldest wines that date back to the early 1800s. <laughs> All right, y'all, we have this one right here. No, not this one. We're going to do this one right here. What is it, Taylor Port? Taylor Port. Port. Now, I don't know nothing about wine, so don't, <laughs> don't, don't listen to me. I'm just going to tell you how it tastes. But we're going to do Taylor Port. This right here was produced in Portugal. It's a port wine became popular in the 1700s. That's a long time ago. Yeah. Man, this right here got 19 to 20% alcohol. Now, I see a couple of people post about these females, so I, I kind of get why y'all like it, but I'm going to find out. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But it, it's real good. They say it's supposed to be served at the meal with a dessert. Dessert, y'all. All right. And the next wine we got here is the uh, Riscato. It's another sweet red wine, and a few facts about it we got is uh, it's a blush wine. It's also made in Italy. And it only has seven percent alcohol. Amen, amen. And most people they like to serve it, you know, after meal after the meal with a dessert, like a cheesecake or a chocolate cake, because it's very sweet. So we're gonna see how it go in a minute. All right, y'all. So we're gonna start it off. Leroy, go ahead. All right. And, put and then the first bags. one we're gonna start with is the uh, Lambrusco. I'd have had it a couple times at the pill. It's real sweet, but I just I ain't never had a whole glass of it. That's dessert. Yep. Man, this thing come out like Kool-Aid. <laughs> I don't need to be drunk and wine in here reminiscing. Oh, I got to stir it up like that. Yep, shake okay. it up a little bit. All right. The reason why you do that, though, you turn around and let it get a little bit of air in it. Because anytime you let the wine get a little bit of air. So I just stir it up like that. I don't know mm -hmm. so I can stir it up. Okay. It, make, it makes the wine better once you stir it up like that. It, it open, the air get a hope to it because it's been in the bottle. And just so would that make it smell different? It makes it taste better it and also smell a little different. Smells sweet, real sweet. All right, I gotta put my pinky out because I'm used to eating you know, my pinky out. That's candy. That's sweet. Real sweet. Just the taste of berries in it and the grapes. It's got a little bubble to it. A little bubble to it. It don't got that tang in it, give you that lock jaw though. It ain't gonna give you that. That's when you're drinking that Cabernet or Merlot or a Zippendale or something like that. But the better the wine is with a Cabernet or Merlot or something like that or Zippendale, it's going to be, you won't have the tannins. That's what makes people, most people's jaws lock down because the tannins in the wine. I've seen a little fat about that. I ain't know yeah, what that was. Yeah, the tannins. The tannins, when you're drinking and it get back there in the back and it just grab, like it grabs grab your jaw. What's the name of Lambrusco. 
Like, he like that. He got, that, that <laughs> that's his new thing yeah. right there. Hey, <laughs> what you get on a scale of one to ten? For a red wine sweet. Hey, it's, it's up there by the eight. Yeah, that's the most proper one. I, yeah. I, I give it I give it about a good I give it a five or six. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, you got to go. You got to go. <laughs> hey, 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 listen, y'all. Listen. I don't drink the sweet wines like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. I, I, I always go with like a, if I'm going anything close gonna be sweet today. What I'm gonna drink would be a a, a menage a uh, uh That's a red blend yeah, or or even a uh, pinot noir. Right. That's a menage a trois. Here's a little old one. We ain't gonna crack that over. I don't know how long it's been sitting here, so Man. we ain't gonna try that out. That, I mean, I, when you when you start yeah. drinking wine good, you step up that, then you I, understand what I'm saying. All right. I give it an eight and a half. You like, like that? Yeah, yeah I like, like that. that. I like that one. Yeah. I like that one. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna take that bottle with me. <laughs> <laughs> I like that right now. That's good. That's good right now. You gotta give your lady a taste of that tonight. Boy, I don't start. <laughs> <laughs> the whole bottle gone tonight. Nice. Ah, uh, y'all. Oh, no, we going to do the Riscato. Riscato, Riscato. Yeah. Riscato. Okay, the next one we're going to try the Riscato. Here go here and go right for y'all. All right, let me pull it up. I'm going to like this one. Yeah, you'll like them. If you like, if you like, if nah. you like the Lambrusco, Eric Scott, you'll most likely like, like that one, too. You want to play that without, oh. Well, you got a good pour, too. You really mm-hmm. going to taste it. Like my song just came on. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, it's about the same. You got the bubbles to it. It's a little bubbly, though. It yeah. got more bubbles yeah. than that. Yeah, that's why most people love it. Yeah. It, smell, it, it don't smell the sweetest, though. Yeah, it's sweeter. It's sweeter. Mm-hmm. It ain't, it ain't, it, it's bubbly, but it's not as bubbly as the Lambrusco. <laughs> You okay? <laughs> you okay? Yeah. Ah, you okay? <laughs> I don't like that. There you go. What you? What you get down the scale of one to ten? It's a little. It's a little flatter. Yeah. It's a little flatter. It's sweeter, but I rather go with the. I like the lamb Bruce though better than that, but I'm gonna finish it off. I ain't finished mine. <laughs> you know where that's go, Leroy? You know where we go? Where, where I would put that at? What? They go, they go to the dust collector shelf. <laughs> we got the dust collector. They're going to be in the refrigerator. Yeah. Well, yeah, it ain't yeah. even going, it's going outside. <laughs> it ain't even going enough for me. Going down the drain. Uh, going down the drain. No, that's a negative for me. Mm-mm. All right. All right, this last one we're going to try. This is the most popular trend with people right now with the females. And they had a little kickback or something. They're going with this Taylor port. And this bottle got 18 to 20% alcohol in it. That's, that's more like it. That's you pretty are, strong for a wine, like so. A whole glass of like four or five you, uh, shots of Hennessy. You got a female friend that had a whole bottle of Taylor Port, y'all just be careful with her. <laughs> she, she might be stumbling a little bit, but we're going to check it out, see how it goes. Drink safe. Yeah, y'all hear that uh, in the background? <laughs> that's a jam, that's old time. Old time. That's what's going to be going I'm, down when you I hear that. I want a whole new glass from that last one. Tell you tell the difference, big difference of this though is it's, it's way lighter. Yeah, you see, it, it's not as it's not as dark. Boy, that smell real good. But it's much sweeter. Boy, that smell like it's liquor smell, almost. Boy. It smell good, me. Let me see, let me see. It's way sweeter. It's much heavier. Oh my God! You see why I say you can't you can't have a lot? Why listen? You like that? Why listen? If you, if you for the call center people. <laughs> Why they need to have this when they get off? Boy, Boy, that be I, right, I have a headache from working this because I know I work in a plant and I'm gonna need some of this. <laughs> Boy, this right here strong. I like it. It's I like it. Now, but it's, it's, it's a lot heavier. It's a lot heavier than compared to them two. It got a, a, a kick to it. Mm-hmm. It got. A, you can tell it's, it's, it got a lot of 18, 19 percent in. I like it. Oh yeah, it tastes very good. I'm gonna add that to the collection. I'm gonna add that. I'm gonna put that in the yeah. You drank too much. Taste a little bit of chocolate in there. I got a little chocolate. You in gonna there. turn into Jody for real, boy? That's mm-hmm. that's Jody? thick, that boy. Can the liquor? Oh okay. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I hope you ain't talking about Jody y'all. Oh, uh, baby boy, baby boy. Hey, uh, you know he 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 yeah, drank too much. Like, yeah what? yeah. He said what, what Jody? What Jody? What Jody? Grab baby. <laughs> 
I like that one, Leroy. I like that one. Guns and butter. <laughs> I like that one. I really do like that one. That one tastes real good. I see why the ladies like it. If you like this, you got some good taste. That's, that's real good. What you get at Leroy on a scale of one to ten? I give it about a six. What about you, Antoine? I get that. I get that ghetto eight because it got more alcohol in it. I like alcohol. No, I'm, you I'm, I'm with you. That's why I'm gonna yeah, do. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get that a nine. I'm gonna get that a nine. I, I, like. I think about this though. You go on a nice date and you want to get a bottle of wine and enjoy this. This ain't gonna be it because yeah. if y'all drink that whole bottle you of said, wine, you, you said you, a date though. You know what happened with dates. Yeah, well, right, but you, 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 you want to drink that? Y'all both gonna, gonna be sick. You gonna yeah, that's, ah. that's the kind that you you cook for your woman. And you had you pull that up for you know a vice versa she cook y'all pull that up you ain't ordering that going out. Well, we better make sure the food done first. You can order that. So you no, order I'm that. not. You, you can order that out the dinner. Who's driving? No, you can order that out the dinner. Have Uber. There you go. Nah, you better hit Uber because she's strong. <laughs> I mean, I like that though. I like that. But this, I don't know, man. That's kind of hard, man. But you got to think about the, the Taylor's number one. It's the price, and then it's a price. And you got to realize this has bubbles. It has a little bubbles. So that's kind of like a champagne, really. Not really, but they they give it a little bit of carbonation in there to make to make to make it sweet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because you see you see the difference when you pour it. I don't know. Let you, me try. You had a bubble. I got to see the difference. Yeah, you Let's like that? Okay. <laughs> Let me see the difference. As you pour as you pour that one. Don't don't pour mine. Don't pour mine. I'm gonna pour my own. See, I like right. how they come out. Round it off. Nah, nah. Round it off. What you mean, run it off? Turn the bottle. I mean, I ain't got time. Come on, man. <laughs> I, I, I've been you drinking liquor. I don't know how to drink. This is my first right. time drinking now, wine. Now look, now, look at that. Look at the difference. Why, yo, you got that much of yours? I just put a little bit because it's heavy. <laughs> yeah. you, see, you, see, you see the bubbles? It's got it's got way more bubbles than what, what the, you know what the what pork wine has. You know what we didn't do? We didn't toast. No. You no can't toast the wine, but you still toast you can't. We can, we can. We can. This is a celebration. You can toast with anything. I see, see, I know that's the best one. All right, that right there gonna have you lit. Yeah, nah, it's too early in the day for that. Right. So how you round it off like that? I can't do all that. I man. learned that from Snuff the Jones. That's the dessert. Right, yeah, that's we, dessert right there. Yeah. This right here, man. We just y'all make toast. We gonna celebrate a life and being able to help give back. It's a great thing y'all got going on in Texas. They like that. And then he got the pinky out. Right. Well, yeah, I like to get a pinky out. When well, listen, out. listen. Ah. It ain't right unless the pinky out tight. Check you out. <laughs> got the pimping in there. Mm-hmm. I said, well, you don't mind taking the bottle with me. Nah, you take it with you. Y'all hear that now? You said yeah. I can take it. And <laughs> yeah, find this new drink. Now, I'll go over there. I'll be like, man, let me get a glass of that. And this guy, boy, you had a long night, boy. Yeah, yeah. Boy, don't, you, this ain't no drinking in one day, though. It's wine. I thought oh, you supposed to drink wine in one day. Well, that's a big bottle, that's boy. That's a big bottle. Man, that's, I used to drink what, whole what, what, that's head bottles. That's a, a 1.75? Uh, oh. It should be a 1.75, if I'm not mistaken, for that one. Yeah, 1.5. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's, that's good, though. I like that, man. I'm glad, I'm glad we did this show, man, because... I'm learning new stuff, man. You know what right. I mean? I, I, I'm, next, I'm, next show, we got to do a Cabernet. Or a Merlot or something like yeah, that. I something, can't even pronounce that. Something, something that, 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 that you'll understand the reason why a lot of people drink the sweet red wines because they can't, they can't, they, that, they haven't learned how to drink Cabernets or Merlots that, or Pinot Noir. Well, that's that's a good cab there. Well, you know really what? Next time we do this show, I'm going to have me a soup and town. Y'all got me soup and Y'all need no soup and town. Y'all talking like y'all yeah, want me to be fancy. Man, you ain't yeah. got to be fancy. You had this Merlot? I haven't had that. I never had that. The Cabernet, that Cabernet is awesome. The chocolate, the raspberry. Which one the cheapest one? Uh, they both the same price. Which Somebody one? Indeed? Uh, out of all of them, which one the cheapest one? Man, Bruce Cole. Right Bruce here? That's why I like it. That's why I like it. It's cheap and good. Just come on here with me, baby. Come on. Man, and Bruce then, the, you know, next time we do a show on some wines, these are some good wines straight from Napa Valley. Very good wines. You know, shout out to okay. my sister for giving me, sending those bottles to me for That's a gift. Yeah, they come in okay. straight from Cali. Okay, yes. okay, yeah, yeah okay. Yeah. They're uh, good wine. I believe they had this one in the pillow. What are doing? Three ounce pours? No, I was doing a six ounce six pour ounce for fifteen dollars. Okay. Right. But okay. which is is very still very cheap yeah. compared to that's a great bottle. Of that one, that one right there. So that's aged longer or something? Yeah, okay. aged longer and it's it's not as sweet. It don't have it don't have all. Man, don't, be pointing, don't be pointing at my bottle. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, you don't feel low, Lambrusco? This, this my. No, I, and then you know, you know once you I step like up it. to the Merlots and the Cavs, it get a whole lot expensive. Yes. So this bottle yes. here. 
I think it was like 125. Yeah. And then the Merlot was like 56 to now, 70. Now how much it is? That's, you can buy a whole case of that Cabernet. $10, $10 y'all yeah. listen. For $10 in tax, you're going to feel good. Yeah. Get all that extra stuff, man. Just get you just get you this. That's how you got to work your way up. Man, you you can't drink if you want to work your way yeah. up, go to Gin and Juice after this. <laughs> oh, <Wow. yeah. laughs> I'm hanging out with Snoop Dogg. Right. Not a drink. <laughs> all right, y'all. Well, that wraps up for this episode of Tasty Tuesdays with Leroy. Hey, and our special back. guest, Antoine Moss. We did an episode on the wine, on the man. Wine. wine. I like it. I like it. And we can take that to the dumpster. And, <laughs> hey, check this out. Well, he said he like two out of three. He feeling the Taylor Port already. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, thank you for coming, uh, tuning in for the episode, yes, and thank Torn for coming and just being our special guest. Let us know some different stuff we didn't know about the wines and stay, uh, stay. Taylor Port on the Taylor Port on. <laughs> <laughs> no, on a serious note, if there's any kind of giveaways y'all can think about, you know, with the upcoming holidays, Thanksgiving, Christmas. Give us some ideas. We'd like to get more involved in helping out in the community. Though, all serious though, you got to give back. That's right. what we want to do. Give back. And if all you right. want to be on the show, DM us, message us, let us know. We always willing to listen. All right, Tasty Tunes and Reviews. Yes, sir. <laughs> Baby.